Hey everyone, welcome back to Tara by Cherie. I'm getting ready to do this reading real quick for my peeps. And uh, guys, limited time, I am doing 15 minute readings. You can just click on the description under the video and let's go. All right, so the first thing I'm seeing is somebody out there is fe feeling anxiety over, you know, just feeling left out in the cold financially, okay? So there's a lot of anxiety with that. Um, Spirit is saying there's something else coming in for you financially, okay, to take the place of what is missing and that you're going to be getting communication on this very soon guys okay and i'm seeing movement with this so this is you know coming soon i don't know a date again i would love to give dates but i i'm not seeing anything regarding a date i have however i am seeing a ton of wands which is a time indicator if we were going to look at the the time i would say within the next three to four weeks okay I'm guessing the latest sometime in September, okay? That's my gut feeling. That's what my intuition is telling me. Guys, if you want to try an experiment, use your intuition on this and try to figure out, like, you know, <clears throat> try to feel uh, when this money is coming into us and post it. Um, I think that would be fairly interesting, okay? It might be fun. All right, let's see who, who gets it. All right, so guys, I'm seeing, um, I'm seeing for those of you who have been just walking around with this burden on your shoulders, I'm seeing this whole new beginning for you. I'm seeing this going away, these bad emotions and thoughts about life. I'm seeing a, a huge change. I'm seeing a new beginning. I'm seeing you moving into new waters and planning you're planning out what's going to bring in your happiness, guys. And I'm seeing something that a lot of you have been waiting for, wanting for a long time. I'm seeing it coming to fruition for you. And there's going to be a lot of celebration around this. I'm seeing you with a significant other and children dancing and having the time of your life and above your head. That um, signifies... Um, a wish fulfillment, something that you've been wanting for a very long time, guys, coming to fruition, okay? So you're going to get it, all right? Um, I don't know how to come across with this other than I'm just going to say it, all right? Some of you that have been feeling extremely defensive and guarded and regretful about things in your life, you are making a decision on your emotions. You're making a decision to not feel that way anymore. It's that simple, guys. You're doing that, okay? You're manifesting this. So here I'm seeing regret. I'm seeing feeling guarded and feeling defensive, okay? All of that. And here I'm seeing that you're making a decision on all that. You're making a decision on how, are you going to continue to, to go through the rest of your life dragging that stuff behind you like a can on a string? No, guys, you're planning on letting it go. You're going to work through those emotions and let them go. And that is going to be your victory. All right, guys. So this is awesome. Okay. Because mostly all of us have had this happen okay some at some point in our lives we've had this bad terrible ending okay and that's what that is we've all gone through it um you know so when i see the comments and i see someone saying oh i've been through so much and i deserve yeah you do everyone deserves nothing but the best from the universe because we're all this big bright light we're all god's children but, but you're not the only one who has, has, you know, gone through hell. Matter of fact, most of us have gone through hell. People have gone through stuff that would make your head spin around. And you think that you've just had this very tough, horrible life. Guys, you gotta, you know, don't take this the wrong way. I love you all dearly, but do not 
walk around being on the pity potty because you're guaranteed to have a shitty life if that's your perception and that's your attitude. All right, guys, you got to change all that. You got to start focusing on the positive. You, you're not a victim. You didn't get a raw deal. Okay. We have all been given eternal life. We come back here. We've lived many lives and we come here to learn and teach and everything we go through is pre-planned. Okay. Nobody came out of the darkness to get you to, to, to kill you or harm you. Well, for most of us, but you know what I'm trying to say, right? You're not a victim. You chose to come back here. You just forgot. You chose. You signed a contract. You chose to come back here and live another life and learn and teach. And along the way, you're helping people that are vibrating on a much lower level than you. All right. And we're not to look down on them. If we're vibrating higher, we're not to look down on low vibrating people. We're to help them. Okay. But do not get in a relationship with someone who's vibrating low and is a third dimensional because they are living their life with no integrity. They don't have the um, lessons under their belt that you have because you've lived more lives and you've learned more, okay? Now here, I'm seeing for some of you, this bad ending caused this tower moment, which is like, you know, your whole world is crashing down around you. That's what that feels like, okay? And we've all gone through something similar, okay? So, Again, don't think you're the only one, guys, okay? Now, I'm seeing things turn around so that you're all of a sudden feeling happy and spontaneous like when you were a kid and you want to get out there and take risks and live life, okay? And here I'm seeing a significant other coming in for you and I'm seeing you here with money all around you and st stability like nothing else, okay? Um, you're stable. You have this new love coming in. This is part of your new cycle, guys. We all have this new cycle, which is not a new beginning. This is a whole cycle of things coming in for our betterment, guys, okay? And, you know, for those of you who are trying to sneak away from love, um, that's up to you, all right? But your person is coming in if they haven't come in already and I'm seeing you guys working really hard you're working hard on something if not at work and that hard work is going to pay off it's bringing the sun guys which is joy and happiness okay um more joy and happiness I got the lovers guys okay <laughs> I'm so excited this is your soulmate, okay? This is your soulmate. This is your person coming in with this pentacle. This is romantic. They have money. The lover's card right next to it signifies this is going to be a super duper powerful love. And this partnership card here, this is the nail in the coffin, guys, so to speak. To say that this person is your soulmate. This is my soulmate card when it comes with these cards, guys. This is your soul mate, okay? And that, I love that. That's so exciting. And I'm so happy for you guys, okay? So so this person, and again, guys, use discernment. I don't want you to pick like a third dimensional and say, but you said the next person coming in was going to be my soul mate. You still have to use your intuition and discernment, okay? Because there's lower vibrating people still out there, all right? And spirit wants you to know that even though you're feeling like you're juggling your money right now and there's not enough, something huge is coming, guys. Something huge that's going to make you want to celebrate, okay? We're all going to be celebrating. And even though you're juggling your money right now, you got the Ten of Pentacles and the Six of Pentacles here. Ten of Pentacles is... You know, well, let's go here first. This is some someone who's going to be giving to you or to us. This is a person who's working to give to us money. This is money, all these pentacles, money, all right? And this ten of pentacles, guys, this is so exciting. This is a lot of money and contentment and celebration. And here you're with the significant other. There's a child peeking around. There's animals, dogs, happy family, just, you know, they have everything that they could ever want, guys. 
That is the reading. Just everything you could ever want rolled up into one is coming. It's coming. All right, guys, have a great day.